Welcome back to my channel, YouTube. If you all are interested in how I came up with this beautiful holiday tablescape, keep watching. Okay, so first I want to let you all know about Ling's Moments. I absolutely love these table scarves. They came in three beautiful, magnificent colors. That's kind of the theme that I'm going with in this particular room. So they came with like a dusty rose, a light rose, and like a really pale blush looking color. And I'm just going to take these three scarves and I'm going to open them up a little bit. Um, kind of level them at best and then uh, kind of figure out what I want to do with them as far as the tablescape. I know that I want them to be um, the focal point of the tablescape, so I'm kind of just thinking about how I want to do them. Okay, so I decided that I am going to give these three uh, scarves just like a braid. So as you can see here, I'm just kind of taking them and just kind of braiding them a little bit, almost like you would just do the three strand braid. And I'll do this on both sides. It's already looking so beautiful. So I decided just to kind of give them a little wider of a feel because I almost want them to be maybe kind of as wide as like a table runner. Um, so I'm just kind of taking them and just kind of pulling them apart a little bit, almost like you would do kind of like a French braid or a fishtail braid. I'm just kind of taking them and spreading them out enough so they'll have some width to sit the items in the middle that I'll be placing here later on. So I decided right here that I actually did not want my scarves to hang off the table. So I am kind of just maneuvering them to fit just the width of the table. And I'm just giving it a little pull forward here just so it can kind of be centered in the middle of the table. And here's what I came up with. It's absolutely beautiful, absolutely. Those colors together, those three colors were awesome. 
So I'm going to start placing the items from our Hobby Lobby haul in the middle of the scarves to create our holiday tablescape. Keep watching. Now this particular vase here is something that I've already had. I was just pretty much shopping my home and I brung this in. It's like that deep wine color. I absolutely love it. It's gonna look really, really good in the space. So these two candles that I just placed down are also um, me shopping my home as well as this pink and gold vase as well that I'm trying to figure out where I want it to go Those are me just of course again shopping my home Finding those and placing those in this holiday tablescape So just the other day, I found this um, deep, I want to call it deep maroon um, pumpkin. I found this in Ross for $8.99, and I thought that it would look lovely in the space as well. I knew that I would be doing a holiday tablescape, so yeah, just added that to the collection, and I am loving it already. Shopped my home for this candle stand as well. Just adding it to the holiday tapescape.
I shopped my home for this uh, pumpkin as well, but I decided against this. I felt that it kind of clashed with what I had going on. So you'll see me take that away. And so I replaced it with this nice little vase that I DIY'd. Um, and I felt that it looked really good in the space. And here we are. I'm still on the hunt for some pink candy canes. I do want to add that to this tablescape. If you know of any places where I can find some all pink ones, drop that in the comments for me. Again, make sure that you all are liking, commenting, and subscribing. I'll be dropping content every week. Y'all have a blessed one. Bye.